Plum Village is my home. Plum Village is the Hawaii chili. Plum Village is my home. Plum Village is my home. inspired to continue this legacy. Tai, our teacher, who has suffered a lot and who has gone through two wars in Vietnam. And his dream as a young monk was to create a live and living monastery where Buddhism is not far away in the clouds, but it is very down to earth where anybody from any background can find and can feel, ah, I can do this. I can breathe mindfully. I can learn to speak more lovingly. You don't have to be Buddhist to do that. You just have to have the intention to be a more loving person. And that legacy that Tai has left behind is so magnificent. That is what has inspired me to continue to be here, continue to invest myself in this place because this is where it began. This is where Thai began to build his international monastic community. Practicing walking meditation is to practice meditation while you walk and uh, you walk and uh, you do you do it uh, as if you are the most the happiest person in the world at the beginning it started with uh, just uh, 30 40 monks and nuns now it has grown worldwide maybe about 800 monastics and in plum village year round we always have 200 residents monks and nuns in Plum Village. And so having a chance to come to Plum Village is not only having a chance to have an opportunity to practice meditation, but it's also an opportunity to be in touch with the monks and nuns. Getting to know a monk and a nun is very special. You get to see how lively and how human they are, but at the same time be in touch with their aspiration and their devotion that they have put into the life of mindfulness. When you enter into Upper Hamlet, the land is very special because it is protected by a oak forest. From the outside looking in, you wouldn't know that there's a monastery inside. Plum Village has been um, expanding and our teacher has put a lot of love into the land. When you come and visit them, you can see the trees that our teacher have planted for now 36 years. And many of the trees are like our older brothers. You can come and feel at ease. You can know that this is a safe place for you to remain still, remain peaceful, remain calm to see inwards, inside yourself, through the practice of sitting meditation, slow walking meditation, mindful eating. And Plum Village now is uh, very alive. We have many retreats that we offer. Retreats for businessmen, businesswomen, retreat for teachers. We have many programs for young people. Every year we have a summer opening. Only in Plum Village, France, is the only Plum Village monastery that opens their home for one whole month. 
for families with children and teenagers. And it is like a Dharma festival in the summer retreat for one whole like month. So Plum Village now is not just a home for monastic, but it is a home for the whole world, a spiritual home where anybody with the heart of openness and a heart of wanting to cultivate compassion and love within the daily life, this is a place to come and to experience. We see that uh, in the last years, our retreats fill up very fast, very fast. In 2018, our summer retreat, the first time it ever happened that our children program for the whole one month of the summer retreat filled up within four to five hours. This has never happened. And this just shows that how many people wish to come and to learn the art of mindful living. And as the monastic community, as hosts, we feel we want, because this is our aspiration, this is why we became monastic, to share the art of mindful living, not just for ourselves, but to share to everyone and everybody who has a heart that wants to be open and that wants to learn to make the practice a part of their daily life, to be able to touch peace, touch happiness and joy and we need your help. And when you help us, you know that uh, you're not just helping the monastery, but you're helping giving someone a chance to come, to stay, to practice, and to heal their suffering, and to cultivate joy and happiness. And by doing this, we all are giving a helping hand in making the world a more peaceful, a more loving, and a more happier place.